Mark, you're out here with the league. You've been doing the social media stuff. How's it been going? Um, it's been going fantastic. Um, we're sharing our video diaries um, each day. It's creating a lot of interaction. Chris Packham, Bill Audi, Brian May Save Me are all sharing this, so it's creating a lot of interaction. They're huge um, supporters. Oh, it's been fantastic. I mean, you know, we're getting a lot of interest in the issue and uh, a lot of people interacting and sending their support. It's been fantastic. But, Brilliant. But one, one thing I would say is that some of our supporters are saying, you know, you know we should be boycotting Malta. And, and I just don't think that that is a sensible solution to anything that's going on. Because ultimately, it's a small, select few number of people that are actually going out and doing the shooting. And so you can't hold the whole nation to ransom because of that. And then you look at what's actually happening. The Maltese people have signed a petition, which is forcing a referendum next year, which will ban spring hunting. You have yesterday the Maltese independent media, all the front pages, the joint forces to call for support for the ban on spring hunting. And because of um, cases of illegal persecution at the start of this hunting season, the government's intervened and has banned autumn hunting until the peak migration ends. I mean, that's unprecedented action. And this is a pro-hunt government, really. And, and they've actually said, because of one or two or three illegal cases, they have now said the, the season is closed. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, a massive, it's a massive, massive thing to happen. I mean, and if you look back at the UK, I mean, you know, we, the, the, persecution of migrator, or, or the persecution of raptors and birds of prey there is unprecedented. It's relentless. We have constant buzzards, with re, you know, red kites, all these being persecuted. Last week, two more hen harriers have gone missing under very suspicious circumstances. So and, this government needs to be applauded, not boycotted. Yeah, well, I mean, we should be applauding them all, these people, for the actions they're taking. They're doing a lot more than we're doing to address, you know, persecution of our own birds. So, you know, are we going to boycott ourselves? No, of course not. But, you know, you've got to, if you really want to help birds in Malta, you should be supporting the Maltese people. You should be um, supporting BirdLife Malta. You should, should be supporting, um, you know, the work that the League are doing out here, a committee against bird slaughter. You have to support the people, not boycott them. Brilliant. I think, uh, I think that gets the message, Mark. Thanks.